Welcome to the report from Tiger Mountain, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to talk about Sri Lanka and the uh, lovely revolution that's going on there. Yes, it's, uh, well, it's not like January 6th, it's the real deal, ladies and gentlemen. Sri Lanka, this week on the report from Tiger Mountain. Alright ladies and gentlemen, yes we're going to talk about the situation in Sri Lanka. Um, obviously uh, there's been actually a, a real revolution, not what we saw on January 6th that the globalists in America are carrying on about. They're having all these hearings, making out of some kind of revolution. All January 6th was, ladies and gentlemen, in America was a few Trump protesters who were rightfully upset and who got a little bit out of hand. They were let into the, uh, you know, like the Senate and uh, caused a little bit of trouble and uh, grabbed the podium and, you know, some guy in a hat got into the main the main section of the uh, Senate and caused some trouble. But what was happening in Sri Lanka is actually a real revolution. Um, obviously, you've seen the beginning of, you know, this whole, um, you know, global warming, um, you know, um, kind of punitive desire to um, basically um, you know, destroy the food supply and to impoverish uh, not only the first world but impoverish even further the third world and so you're seeing you know I guess it's a kind of canary in the coal mine situation you're seeing in Sri Lanka there was a kind of problem with the kind of um, you know fertilizer um, you know there's all these changes they want to make to agriculture to do with global warming it's, it's all a lie ladies and gentlemen it's, it's all manufactured to create a situation where the global elites further impoverish and control everybody and obviously they want people to be as poor and miserable and powerless as possible so it's all that's the real agenda of global warming and climate change. So you're seeing, um, you know, this kind of reaction in Sri Lanka. You're seeing it echoed also around the world in countries like uh, Holland uh, and in Italy as well. You're seeing farmers, you know, they want to do things with like fertilizer and you know what I mean. You're seeing the foot and mouth uh, situation in, in in Bali. You know, I mean, other globalists releasing new strains of foot and mouth to destroy the uh, the meat um, thing because they all want us to eat bugs or they all want us to be vegan or eat vegetables. God knows. But something very strange is going on ladies and gentlemen and you see one of the first major reactions against it in Sri Lanka which is where the people uh, essentially um, stormed I think they stormed the parliament house there they stormed the uh, the dictators or the whoever the previous leader was they stormed his house and um, they also stormed some of the courts so it was a proper revolution I mean it was absolutely like a sea of people like it must have been like half a million people or something stormed these buildings and so I mean there was no option the, the police couldn't do anything um, not even the military could do anything to stop this it was so large so that's how you do it ladies and gentlemen by the way if you actually want to you know everyone has to go out in the street and you just retake your country from these bastards hopefully um, we're going to see um, you know a, a new regime that actually is going to fight globalism and reject this all this um, kind of restrictions in relation to agriculture and the environment which is all a lie which is all about just being punitive uh, towards people and punishing them so I think it's very exciting what's going on in uh, in Sri Lanka I think it is a positive um, revolution and we should applaud it here and report from Tiger Mountain fans here at the Unshackled um, because I mean basically that's if we really want to defeat the globalists we've got to resist them you know seriously and um, you know, there's this fascinating footage of the leader of Sri Lanka was escaping the country on um, you know on basically a military um, you know a naval vessel so that's what we want to see here ladies and gentlemen that's what we want to see in America that's what we want to see all over with globalists you know uh, getting the hell out and actually there was an interesting um, thing that happened in France as well where actually the far right teamed up with the far left and they uh, it was something to do with agriculture again because there's all these new laws that are coming in and they teamed up against it and they defeated the globalist movement so again once again you know our friends on the authentic left and the authentic right can stand together against globalism because we have the same enemies ladies and gentlemen and this is a global problem globalization and globalism is a global problem so we need a globalist nationalist revolution around the world where the peoples of the world stand up for their nations and throw off these globalist leaders and Sri Lanka is just the beginning ladies and gentlemen we're going to retake the world and we're going to re-establish our sovereignty globally so thank you very much